Okay, go ahead. Muzzle or buck we have here. Taking a northeastern Connecticut this afternoon. Unfortunately, we didn't have the camera with us, but um, just trying to take a little video of it right now. Um, very proud of uh, what happened, and um, it all worked out. Came together tonight. That night, that's ethical shot, and um, this is what we had to show for it. That is a beautiful muzzleloader buck for anybody. That is just a nice buck. You don't see a lot of Connecticut bucks coming out this beautiful. How far was he, Jay? He was about 80 yards with the final shot tonight. Kind of snuck in on me and um, was able to put it together and uh, real fortunate and lucky. I wouldn't call it lucky, I'd call it skill. What time did you get in the stand? About 3.15 this afternoon. Say that again? 3.15 this afternoon and um, the final shot came together around uh, 4.20. And so that was legal? I sure hope so. <laughs> Absolutely. It wasn't a Ted Reuter deal? No, it was not. <laughs> what are you going to do with this one? This is going to be a trophy. I'm going to save it for a long time. You're going to have it mounted? Absolutely. Oh, yeah. Who's going to mount it? I'm not quite sure yet, but um, it's going to be put in the fine hands. <laughs> All right. And what do you got there for a muzzle loader? It's a Thompson Center uh, Triumph. 50 caliber with a 245 grain power belt bullet. Did the job very well. How far did it go after you shot it? About 30 yards. Oh, nice. Looks like a perfect shot placement. Yep. Everything came together. Right in behind the front shoulder. All right, very good job. Last questions, boxers or briefs? Boxers. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else you want to say? That's about it for tonight. How long have you been deer hunting? Since I was knee high to a grasshopper. Oh, wait a minute. Say that again? Since I was knee high to a grasshopper. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alrighty. Very good job, Jake. Congratulations. Beautiful deer. You worked for it. That's for sure. <laughs>